names in the uh, acupuncture points. You, if this is a shoulder blade, it's right here at the tip of right at the tip between the shoulder blades, right? You can try it on each other later when you push onto someone. You always have a force pushing. You feel the power. Um, thinking like the whole body is involved, right? Even if I'm actually very weak like this, right? You will generate a lot of power. Okay, so apart from learning how to pierce this way, um, you may also just cut down. Yeah, you may also learn how to step. Okay, now I'm leading with the with the sword. Okay, I'm using this as a weapon to help me um, move correctly. Okay, so I'm basically moving in. Right, once I'm here, of course I, I will continue to keep check on this. Right, so that like Eric can't do anything and slip. Right. Right, um, and also from here, I can hit there, I can hit there, I can hit there, or I can keep stepping back and um, hit the back as well too. Okay, so there are many, many sort moves, right? Many, many sort moves. Thank you, Eric. Um, this is just one example. So when I'm fighting someone without a sword, can I borrow Eric again? Right, if, the, if someone's power. You see how like, I'm actually like moving like a sword, right? Moving in, so again, moving like a sword. I can fight here, or I can even step further back and bring the opponent down backwards. Okay. Then of course like Lan, Shao, right? So that's the classic move. Yeah, thank you. Yeah. So that's a classic move, right? So you need to like if someone comes in, I go. Whoa, whoa. Things like that, right? I don't do anything. So if we interact, I would actually be doing things like that so that I can have it. So that Harvey, um, some of them are Kulo Wing Chun uh, power methods, some of them are Tai Chi, uh, Imperial Tai Chi uh, power methods. Okay, now any one, any questions about, because we've got, like, now we've got the boring bits over. Like this is a fun bit. Like any any questions over this? I would be more like as soon as I get control, right? I'll be actually be moving him around and throwing him around as well too, so he doesn't get second of that. Possibly if you hit me in the stomach, right? I won't be taking it full on hard like this because if I do, I'm just going to get damaged. But what really I'm doing very first minutely is that like when Beyond hits me here, my body is actually doing this, right, to dissipate it power, right? So which message can you do Right, hard. You'll notice that, like, it goes right through me. Aha, hala, hala, come on. Hala, hang on, four times hard. Yeah, hard. Even hard. Yeah, right here. You need to hit me where it really hurts, yeah, right here. You see? Yeah, one more. Yeah, thank you. You see, like, the thing is, like, I need to be able to control my body, right? And I need to be able to actually like dissipate, dissipate the force on the next line. That's not going to work much, right? But not if I actually like draw the power out of Eric. Oh, sorry, 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 I'm just there. But if I draw, for example, if someone punches coming, I would cover with that curve, hope with this curve, hope with this curve, hope with this curve, and finish the fight quite easily. Yeah. Um, this sort of spiraling force, right? So imagine if this is a knife, like this comes, right? If I, this is karamba, this if you have knife, right? Five cuts already. Okay, so basically, one, two, three, four, five, five cuts already. So once.